Hey guys, welcome back to TechEdLearning.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at the uh, ruler and all the many lines that are on it. It may be a little overwhelming at first if you're just starting to learn how to read a ruler, but don't be too concerned about all these lines that you see as it's a pattern and that pattern repeats itself at the beginning of each inch. So really we just need to learn the lines between 0 and 1. Um, so let's focus in over on this area. What you'll find is there's some different length lines and you'll see that some of those lengths repeat themselves. Um, the shorter ones are sixteenths, the next size up would be an eighth, and um, then we have quarters, and then there's half. For this segment of learning a ruler, let's focus on the half and the quarters. I'm going to use a, a ruler tool to show you that this is half of an inch from zero to one we are about halfway through so this long line very easy to pick out because it's the longest line in between is your half inch line the next size down here is the um, the quarter inch lines and those are fairly easy to find as well because they are again fairly long um, so again we have the half inch line in the middle the quarter inch line is the next size down and on the other side we have a three quarter inch line if you uh, prefer to view it this way this is a quarter of the distance from zero to one and if I continue my red line here this is half the distance from zero to one and again this is three quarters of the distance from zero to one and if you needed a full inch you bring this out to here and that would be a full inch or one over one once you understand your, your quarter your half and your three quarter we want to do some practicing on those to practice this I found a very useful game on the internet it's called the ruler game and there's a link on the website just how to get there right below this video once you get to the ruler game um, you're going to want to set it to quarters and if you're really starting out you, you can turn the timer off we don't necessarily have to do that right now uh, to change it to quarters and then start a new game and it's asking you right here it says one and three quarters so I'm going to find one and a three quarter inch line and I need to click on that and then it tells me something different it says find the half inch mark it says one and three quarters so I find the one inch line and I go to three quarters now it wants me to find the two inch line so I find that and so on and you just keep on looking down looking for those dimensions and see if you can find them now eventually you are going to make a mistake your mouse moves right when you click the button you're going to get a strike um, another way that you get strikes is over here you'll see there's a timer counting down and if that counts down before you find your answer well you just got another strike the three strikes in your out rule does apply, so once you get three of them wrong, your game is over. Now there is a score here. Uh, your teacher's going to tell you what score they're looking for. Um, I typically think if you can get over a thousand on any of these units, it's, you've pretty much mastered that, and you can move on to the next one. So what we're going to do now is go ahead and go to the link and play this, and once you get to whatever your teacher recommends for a score, come on back and show, watch the next video and that will show you what to do.